Hello guys, this is FIFA Shows here, bringing you episode 2 of Ferdinand First. I've got two matches in this episode for you guys, along with four new players, including my first known rare gold. I'm just quickly going to tell you guys the player of the episode, as a lot is going on and we don't have much time. So the player is my right winger, McGlashan. His pace and agility have been very useful, and in three games he has got as many assists and has scored one goal. So into the first game anyway, the team does have low chemistry, but also some decent players. This is the semi-finals of the Community Cup, so anything can happen. And as you can see here, I'm playing some good passing, just trying to get a grip of the game early on. And that's rewarded with a nice goal from Proctor, making it 1-0 to myself just after 4 minutes. And that is the first half, but not for the whole game. As you can see, my opponent plays a nice through ball to his striker and puts the ball past my keeper with ease and that is the final result guys one all that leaves me with two upgrades which I will show you in just a second when the celebrations have stopped so first of all I've swapped out my non rare bronze left winger Park for a much pacier and more agile rare bronze called Graham who just like my right winger plays for Cheltenham Town Cheltenham really like pacey wingers so, looking at his stats, his only real good attribute is his pace 82, but it does actually feel a lot quicker. He cost me 450 coins, and so was a good buy. And now for the second player, we have another rare bronze, and he's going to replace right centre mid Ruffles. The man is called David Sires, and he plays for League One side Doncaster. At 1000 coins, he is one of the more expensive players in the team, and at the minute, and his price of course is probably due to his 76 pace but he just looked pretty good overall so now on to the next opponent who seems to have a pretty solid 3-5-2 hybrid with team of the season Scarion at CM at Cam even who does look like a good player the team is also mostly silvers so we could have quite a hard time but let's hope he isn't good at FIFA so now we are into the gameplay I do open up the scoring with Proctor who got player of the team last episode and has played very well this round too. And just look at the finish. That is immense guys for bronze and I quite rightly celebrate the goal. It's not every day you see bronze play shooting like that. Please excuse me I am mega buzzed. On to the next highlight. As you can see I lose the ball and my opponent quickly counter attacks playing a through ball to Benzia and I did want to bring my keeper out but I thought he would just pass it across so I did not and the result was I ended up conceding via Benzia's finish Benzia's finish even so that making the score one all am I going to get beaten live on twitch so then the game after 100 minutes I win possession play the ball through and do put the ball back in the to in the back of the net to make it 2-1 but glashing with the goal and I'm not going to lie guys I did waste time after I scored but that didn't stop me scoring again and that goal you will see right now and this is the final goal of the game it makes it 3-1 I've started the move with some excellent build play and score the goal so for the upgrades I decided to upgrade the silver centre mid Prattley with the goal player O'Hara, who has some really good stats, I was put in the team due to his good shooting, passing and defending. He cost me 450 coins and I'm really looking forward to using him. Just a note here guys, I did swap him out for my bronze on the video, but that was a mistake in the matches of silver will not be used. And as always, thanks for watching.